Good morning, folks. Uh, we got in a long-awaited large saltwater fish order. Um, bear with me. I'm going to go through them with you, but it's Wednesday morning, but technically it's my Monday morning, and I'm just getting a first look at some of these fish myself. So let's get into it and see what we got. We have a very nice unicorn tang, beautiful queen angel, past mid-transition. She's almost got her adult colors, bicolor fox face. We got a pair of blue throat triggers in here. Porcupine Puffer, beautiful Threadfin Angel, I almost missed him. Clown Tang, um, that about covers, oh, there's a Klein Butterfly hiding back there. That about covers up here. Down here, we've got a Spiny Burfish, Emperor Angel, juvenile colors, but he is large, so I'd assume the color change is going to start soon. These Perch, these guys are really cool. We still got two zebra mores. Beautiful, beautiful powder brown tang. This butterfly I have not encountered before. We got in some stuff that I have not seen before in all honesty. Got in two lions in this tank. Snowflake more. Nice pair of clowns, squirrel fish. Indigo hamlet hiding up there in the corner. Very cool in the grouper family. They stay a little bit on the smaller side will eat anything he can get in his mouth, so be careful of that. Nice large pair of black Ocellaris clowns. Those look like they're breeders. Striped bristle tooth and a pair of Heniacus butterflies. Once again, cool looking fish with the Heniacus, but they're not reef safe. Uh, Goldhead sleeper goby, rock beauty, small one spot fox face. You guys were looking for fox faces, we get out a lot of fox faces from what I can see. Everybody's still waking up, so there's a lot of fish in here that are not out of hiding yet. As you can see in this coral group, they're all just kind of tied up in there. Very nice Formosa chorus wrasse. There's like five fish hiding under that piece of coral. Got a royal grama. Zebra bar gobies, which we haven't had in a while. A lot of you guys see them in our display tank and would like some. We got four of them in. Bicolor chromis, cool variation on the chromis. Not just your regular old green chromis. Half black, half white. Very cool fish. A sunset butterfly. Once again, not reef safe, but that is a gorgeous, gorgeous fish. Another rock beauty up here. Scopus tang. Oh, and a fish we have not had in a long time. We got some flame angels in. There's one in there. He's being very shy right now. I believe we got more than one. I'm not sure. Little flame angel. We have not seen them in a very long time. Beautiful pair of swallowtail zebra angels. That male is enormous. Rock beauty, bicolor pseudochromus, wire tail antheuses, one male, three females. Some very small blue hippos. Very small little guys. We got in two blue-headed tilefish. People love these guys, they go fast. They're very large, they are reef safe. You need a good top for them though, they do like to jump. What is possibly the largest copper band butterfly I've ever seen. He's close to the size of my hand. Uh, another Scopus tang, some jewel damsels, diamond goby. Dragon goby, cool unusual fish called the jackknife. I like them a lot. A lot of people are like, that's just a boring fish. That's a cool looking fish in my book. Got in some larger PJ Cardinals, another very large copper band butterfly, good sized coral beauty, another diamond goby, ruby red dragonettes, some citron gobies. These guys are really cool. They don't exactly have a suction cup on their stomach, but they will stick to the glass and just sit there, and it's kind of cool to watch them. Very friendly little reef safe fish. We have a bicolor angel. He's hiding in the back. A couple of red fire fish, some more liar tail antheuses, little tiny naso tang. There's a rabbit fish blending into the background like they do in the morning when the lights first come on, and a bunch of assorted wrasses in here. Down here, we've got a raccoon butterfly, flame hawkfish, clown tang, another bicolor pseudochromis, scooter blenny, chalk bass, exquisite fairy wrasse. Up here, these guys might be my favorite fish that came in. I have never seen them before. They're called skunk tile fish. White body, bright red stripe. The reading I've done on them this morning, they max out five, six inches tops. They need a deeper sand bed because they like to bury themselves. 
They are reef safe. They do better in pairs from what I read. They are tile fish, so tight fitting lid because they like to jump. Another very small one spot fox face. Royal Dottie back. Forktail Blenny is in here. Baby Blonde Naso. A Lamarck Angel. Nice little guy. You can watch him grow up in your tank. Pencil Rass. Pink Spotted Watchman Goby. Down here we have a very nice sailfin. Juvenile, very small. Diamond Goby. Another Flame Angel. Starkey Damsels. Yellow Watchman. A lot of you guys have been looking for them. Twin Spot Rass. Cool little fish. Bicolor Blenny in here somewhere. Spanish hog that came in a couple of weeks ago. Up here, another favorite of mine, but once again, you need a very tight lid on your tank because they're escape artists, is this banded snake eel. When there's a tight lid on there, out and about, swimming around, this guy will completely bury himself in the sand. So you look at the tank and you can't find him. As long as you got a tight fitting lid, he's buried in the sand completely. Otherwise, he might have gotten out on you. You need a good lid for these guys. Enormous pair of pink skunk clowns. I enormous. That guy's got to be about three and a half, four inches. Dwarf lion, another rabbit fish, another clown tang, lemon peel angel. She is on hold right now. Bicolor fox face, another coral beauty. Down here, got some more damsels. Another sail fin, a little bit larger. Nice size convict tang. Very nice size diamond goby. Decent flame hawk. Very small PJ Cardinal in here. He's about the size of my thumbnail. That's about it for back here. In the inverts, I haven't totally gone through the inverts yet, but I do know we got in turbo snails, which you guys have been looking for forever. So come on in and see us today, tomorrow, this weekend. We'll be here waiting for you. Have a good day, guys.